In various metal machining and forming processes, there are ways of dramatically reducing how much lubricant or coolant is used. These methods are usually grouped under the term near-dry machining, or more inclusively, minimum quantity lubrication. MQL comprises technologies and practices for applying machining fluids only at the location and in the amount that is needed for the part and process. MQL can be applied to multiple manufacturing operations, says Jeff Coffey, product engineer at Unist Incorporated in Grand Rapids, Michigan. MQL is a little bit bigger of an umbrella than near-dry machining. MQL can also apply to the amount of lubrication needed for sheet metal forming operations, uh, blanking, forming, cutting, anything uh, along those lines. Whereas near-dry machining is more specific to machining operations such as mills, drills, you know, turning operations, tapping. Efficient, environmentally friendly practices of near-dry machining can create several kinds of cost savings and improvements for a manufacturing shop, including significantly reduced fluid use, safer cutting fluids and lubricants, fewer employee health hazards, faster machining speeds and feeds, longer tool life, lower fluid disposal costs, a cleaner shop, and reduced maintenance. Both large and small companies can reap the advantages of near-dry machining, even though their traditional cooling methods may still be effective. 